Not too long ago, I found a collection of amusing police blotter reports from the newspaper of a wealthy town, and the entries contained insanely trivial things, such as a resident called police about his recyclable containers. He said someone had tipped them over. He called the police for that. Someone rang a person's doorbell and disappeared. Police responded and found a delivered package on their doorstep. And a resident told the police that a vehicle passed her house two times within the past five minutes. The blog I found these on said that the average house in the neighborhood went for around four million dollars. So I thought it might be fun to make phone calls to residents of this neighborhood, and I figured that rich people were the types to still have landline telephone service. So I looked on whitepages.com. And I went to the reverse address tab. From there, I typed in the names of the streets that were in the various police blotter entries, which gave me the names and addresses of most of the residents in the area, and a nice little map labeling all of the houses. From there, you just click on each of the names, and it will show their phone number if one's available. After getting the listed names, I typed in their address to Google Maps and used Street View to look at their house, so I can reference things that I see at their house in the phone calls to them. Hello. Hello, is this Kim? Kim, Kim, hello, Kim. Yes. Oh, hey, um, this Roy down the street. Hi. Hi. Well, I I was jogging past your house and um, one of your lights are out on your gate. Oh, okay. It's burnt out and it looks stupid. It makes it look like all these hobos live here. And you have two gates and like one light is out on each gate, so it looks extra. Oh, really? Extra hoboy. Oh, really? Yeah, you might want to get someone out there immediately and, and change the bulbs, because, I mean... Ugh. I'm sorry, where do like, you live? Oh, just kind of around the corner, not too far. On Heritage Court? Yeah, well, no, I'm 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 actually on Holbrook. Oh, you're on Holbrook, and you're telling me my house looks like a hobo? Well, it's just because the lights are out. I mean, and that dumb adobe wall, but... Yeah, I mean, I just... The adobe wall? Well, I mean, it looks, you know, it's not bricks. I mean, it doesn't look like the one in front of our house, which is on the National Registry of, you know, famous walls. I, I'm sorry. Are you serious? Yes, ma'am. No, you can't be serious. You're from Holbrook, and you're kidding me that you think my acre property doesn't come up to standard with yours? No, I'm just saying that the wall looks kind of gay and the lights are out. That's the main thing. The lights are oh, out, so you probably okay, want to have... Uh, uh, okay, you just said my wall looks gay. Well, I'm um, sorry, but don't you think you're just being absolutely, ridiculously rude? Maybe you should... It put, looks gay. Put bricks up instead of whatever that is. That, it, I have bricks? Looks, I don't have bricks on my wall. No, no, I'm saying maybe you should have bricks instead of... It looks like drywall or something. It looks like you just... I don't have drywall. I have... Um, plaster on my wall oh that's expensive even worse plaster on my gate it, is it very expensive because i mean it looks like yellow and fading it looks like plaster inside of a house that someone smokes inside a lot and it gets all yellowish and gross really it, like mean, when did you move in this neighborhood my opinion your opinion your opinion is um absolutely not respected because this is an expensive wall that we paid for and expensive you suckle got, that got, we've redone. So and just the fact that you are coming up with this ridiculous moment that you... How did you even get my phone number? It's in the phone book. But, I mean, you got ripped off if that's an expensive wall. I mean, I... I th- oh, really? I thought you were just How saving- about you just move out of the neighborhood and you then s- you could you could live somewhere else? I thought you were just saving money with that wall. or like you Really? Could- oh, maybe I should hire you. What do you do? Like, are you a garbage man or what do you do? Yeah, I'm I, uh, like I would be a garbage man. Come on. Oh, I know. I don't know. There's all kinds of people with stupid opinions. Oh, he's just a Democrat. Well, Let me guess. Do you think all garbage men have stupid opinions? No, I don't think all garbage men. I just think you do. Do, do you like stand? I think stand you out you're and, absolutely uh, rude right now. On garbage day and yell at the garbage man like, "Oh my God, your opinions are so stupid." Oh no, I actually don't because I don't go out and give my garbage man opinions because they well, take know. You my were, you were making fun of, You're making fun of garbage men. So I just figured, you know, you just really like, didn't like and garbage what, men. What? Who the hell are you? I'm sorry that I offended you. I just want to let you know that your lights are out. Oh, you offended me? No, you didn't offend. You offended everyone in this whole neighborhood. I did. How? And the simple fact that I I don't even know where you're coming from. Why? Well, I told you I, I live. You know, just not too far away. 
over on Holbrook. Obviously, oh really? And you think this is offensive? Well, I just saying your fence looks like white trash. Is all. I'm, I'm, oh. I don't mean to be offensive. I'm just. Like, Seriously, and, hon, why don't you come over and we can discuss it? I mean, it's bad enough that it, you, you have a drywall wall there, but you have the lights around. I don't you have do drywall wall. I have stucco wall. Oh, stucco, same thing. You really should replace. Oh, it. really? Oh, lights. what do you have? Mine's what, br- mine's what brick. It's cheap, on the it's uh, in your trailer. What do you have? Oh, in my trailer on Holbrook. Yeah, okay. It's it's a, it's on the national registry. It's a famous wall. Oh, like really? They, they web- oh, I'm so proud of you. They make websites about our wall. Oh, really? Oh, that's, you know, that's so fantastic. What what daddy got you there where you're at? Oh, I, I earned this wall myself. Oh, I, really? I, I built you it obviously in- didn't because you wouldn't have this much rudeness to actually say something like this. We- we built like it. We've in, improved this house more than when we moved in. Well, I, I'm sure. From, I mean, your house looks nice. I, I like your house, even though you have that big satellite dish from the '80s. I mean, what is that? Is I that, don't have a satellite dish in my house. Who the hell is this? Where are you coming from? Have you looked? We at, don't have a satellite dish in our house you anymore. Know, you have one of those gigantic satellite dishes from the '80s. Like, no, never honey, that's been gone for years. Uh, I, it's Seriously, not, you need who to is your, this? Look on your roof because it's still up there. It's right? not on our roof. It's, like it's, it's been gone for over three years. Twelve foot diameter satellite dish on your roof. Uh, no, we don't have. We have Direct TV. So I'm not sure who this is, but you're not funny, and I'm done with you. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hi, is Carlos there? Uh, no, he's not. Who's oh, calling? Oh, is this Maria? Maria? Yeah, who's this? Oh, did I reach Maria? Who is this? Oh, it's Roy. Don't freak out. I I just I I'm a neighbor of yours and I keep getting your mail. I've been I like I'm receiving your mail for some reason. I don't know why. My mail? Yes. Yes, it's like all the mail from your house for Carlos and Rubio and Margarita. It's all coming to my house. I don't know why. Where 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 where's your house? Oh, it's just uh, it's it's nearby. I'm on Mar- Marymount Avenue. You're on Mary. How weird! I know it's crazy. Well, can you pop it into my mailbox, or 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 I can pick it up oh, from no, you? Oh no, 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 no! I'm not gonna give it to you. Like here, I've got like the mail here. I'm gonna rip it and I'm ripping up your mail, ripping it. Why? Just because I'm I'm a I'm a sociopath, and I'm just gonna rip up your mail. Oh, this is a scam. No, it's okay, not a bye-bye. scam. No, how would I be scamming you? Hello. Hi, is, um, this is Terry. Terry Cross. Yes. I was calling for Michael. Is Michael around? Yeah, he is. Is this the horseshoe player? Yeah. Oh, okay, Terry. I'm sorry. Just a second. I'm, I'm sorry it took me so long to call. Mike, this is Terry, the horseshoe player. Terry? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Hi. Hi, it's Terry, the horseshoe player. Yeah. <laughs> how are you? How are you this evening? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That's enough of the small talk. We have to get to business. Just, just, uh, just okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, I drove by your house today. You did? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I saw the the dying shrubs out in front. Like, not, <laughs> not very big. Just try and grow those bigger and like put a little more effort into your landscaping. Yeah, I looked the other way. Yeah. That big ugly tree, it looks like it belongs in a haunted house. <laughs> yeah. It looks like, I mean, basically, your house alone makes the entire neighborhood look like a bunch of hobos live there. Really? It's like a na- <laughs> neighborhood of hobos. <laughs> Have you been drinking? No, oh, no, no, of course not. I don't drink. <laughs> so, we're going to play horseshoes soon? Yeah. I'd love to play horseshoes. Saturday. Horse- yeah, I, I'm looking forward to Saturday. Yeah, I haven't played re, uh, in, in a while, but uh, well, I'm a pro. But yeah, I'll, I'm, I'll probably be out there Saturday. Okay, I'm looking forward to. It. I'm a pro. I'll, I'll pretty much uh, make you look. Are like, you ready? Yeah, I'm gonna make you look like an idiot. <laughs> like you're gonna lose every game, and you're just yeah. gonna look like a huge fool. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, what are you guys up to tonight? Oh, I'm just. Sitting, sitting in front of the fireplace, having some hanky-panky? I'm watching the ball game now. Oh, who's playing? 
the Giants and, and, and oh the Padres. Oh, my God, I just don't care at all. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm not much into those kind of sports. I just, I'm really, horseshoes are my life. Really? Yeah, yeah, I mean, fuck baseball, fuck basketball and football, <laughs> fuck, fuck it all, fuck all that shit, all that goddamn shit. <laughs> yeah. it's, they have nothing on horseshoes. Yeah, yeah, well, keep up the, uh, the good work and oh, it'll well. probably help, you, help your game. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm not wasting my time watching um, whatever the Giants is. What is that, football or something? Well, yeah. Close enough? Uh, that's it, it, the only thing that, that's on, so. Oh, I doubt that. I mean, how many channels? I leave it on, but. Uh, how many channels do you have? Yeah, most of the time I hardly eat. I, yeah. I, I, rang, I rang the doorbell and you weren't home when I drove by. Um, yeah. Yeah, I, really, I, did, I didn't want to visit or anything. I just needed to use the bathroom. <laughs> well, so I, I was forced. The bath, there's a bathroom in the back too, in the backyard. Yeah, well, I mean, I, I peed on one on that tree, that haunted house-looking tree. Yeah, yeah. I peed all over yeah. it, and then, uh, you know, I had to go number two. Oh my goodness! And um, I you're th- in trouble. Yeah. Oh no, it was fine. It, it worked out all right. And I, I wiped my ass on that mailbox. You're kidding? No, I'm sorry. Yeah, I better check that. I better check that out. Just, just on the pole, not on the handle or anything. It's I'm not gross. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. okay. Where do you live? Oh, I'm um, just you know, not I'm not even ten miles away. Maybe fifteen. Oh, somebody's at the door. I better get going. But I'll see you on Saturday for horseshoes. Yeah. And I'm horseshoes. I'm going to wipe That's the horseshoe day. Yeah, I can't wait for Saturday. I'm going to like just Okay. I'm, I'm going to wipe wipe the fucking field with you on horseshoe day. You're gonna, Oh. I'm going to Great. Cuz I haven't played in a while. So well, that's that's fine. Yeah, well, I mean, yeah, you can use that as an excuse, but whatever. I mean, it's not going to, you know, make me go easy on you or anything. Oh, that's that's okay. It's only a game. <laughs> no, I don't look at it like that. I mean, yeah. Oh, I, yeah, I absolutely look at it like that. Oh, no, it's not just a game. Shit's going to get real on Saturday. Holy. Jeez. Yep, yep. I pretty br- I better bring a uh, uh, mask. Yes, bring a mask. <laughs> yeah. if, if you show up without a mask, I'm just going to call you a pussy. Well, that's okay, too. That makes sense. <laughs> okay, well, I'll, I'll see you Saturday. I can't wait. Okay. All right, well, uh, bye. Thank- bye. Bye, Michael. Bye. H- have a nice mm-hmm. evening. Give your wife yeah. ki- kisses, kisses and hugs for me. <laughs> and, and maybe a grope, okay. a grope or two. Take care. All right, goodbye. Hello? Oh, hi, is this Matthew? Yes. Yeah. Oh, hey, I've been, um, I, I've, I've drove by your house and I, I noticed that cute puppy dog mailbox you have yeah and i was wondering if i could buy it money's <laughs> money's no object i really would like that puppy dog mailbox well you have to talk to deb <laughs> well i mean okay yeah sure i'll talk to deb <laughs> okay uh deb uh it has sentiments about you so i i don't know if your quest will be <laughs> Deb? Did your kid make it in, like, school or something? A guy wants to buy a puppy dog mailbox. <laughs> nope. Deb said nope. <laughs> oh, I mean, can I can I just talk to her? I think I can talk sense into her. All right. Wait a second. Deb, he wants to talk to you. Nope. <laughs> Is it look like the puppy dog that I hear um, barking in the background? Uh, that's uh, Dondo and Kiwi. <laughs> oh, okay. That doesn't answer so, the question at right. all. Um, so okay, sorry. <laughs> well, the reason I want to buy it is because it like I drive by your house every day, mm-hmm. and it's just like when I drive by, it's fucking looking at me. It's fucking <laughs> oh, well. looking at me. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna put that fucking thing in the fireplace. Uh, no, okay. I'm gonna put it. Okay. I'm gonna burn it in the backyard. You tell no, Deb. No, 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 no. Deb, I'm <laughs> sick of that fucking thing looking at me. Oh, well, I, sorry. I'm, I'm gonna like put. I'm gonna start like uh, putting a, a, sh- a shirt over it or something, a coat. 
I'd, like throw oh, well. a bed sheet over the top of it so it'll stop looking at me with its dead right. fucking eyes. Oh well, sorry. What, what the hell? <laughs> did, did like one of your kids make that? Uh, no, it's the kid's favorite. So, so. it's well. I mean, <laughs> it, it, but it needs to stop looking at me. Can you face yeah. it in the other direction? Sorry, <laughs> I need it to face in the other direction. Sorry. I want you to turn that mailbox. I'm, if you don't do it, I'm going to do it myself. I want it to turn. I want it to face the other direction. Oh, well. H- how is it mounted on there? Is it just take Phillips screws or? Okay. Um, I didn't need to bring a socket wrench because I'm no, going no, no, no. to turn that thing around. Please don't. No, it's def- It's going to happen. I'm sick of that fucking thing looking at me every single morning. Every single morning, every single afternoon when I drive by, it's just looking well, at me. Don't look at it. Well, no, I, I can't help it. Like I drive by and it's just staring at me. It's oh, well. r- really starting to piss me off. Well, Something's please don't touch it. Got to be done about that thing. Nope. I'm, I'm tired of it. All right. L- let me at- just let me talk to Deb. No, she doesn't want to talk about it. Uh, and seriously, okay, uh, um, just leave our mailbox alone. It's okay. been with us for 28 years, and it's uh, our kid's favorite. I'm I'm tired of it though. Like it's got to stop. It's, it's got- our property, and uh, <laughs> anyway, somebody's got to okay. do something, and I'm going to be the one to do it. No. Good night. Bye. Fuck that fucking mailbox. Man, look at that thing. It's just looking at me and won't stop. I want to punch that stupid thing in the face. Anyway, subscribe to us on Facebook.com slash phone losers, Twitter.com slash phone losers, Facebook.com slash live prank show network, and even the stupid Tumblr if you want to. And visit phonelosers.org for live shows and lots of other things. And share this video right now. I command you. The cute puppy dog mailbox commands you to just stop whatever you're doing and share this video. Share it on your MySpaces and your GeoCities websites and maybe post it on your favorite Usenet group. Just share the hell out of it, please. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to do this.